Hello, welcome to Unlimited Adventures. My name is Ben. Today we're going to go over my generic engineer build for Deep Rock Galactic. This is the second class I have for each max promotion, and it's really fun to play. Okay, let's get into this. First, my primary weapon for the, that I use is the Warthog Auto 210. It's a semi-auto shotgun that does decent damage. It will one-shot normal glyphids if you hit them in the face with it. I think it's pretty solid overall. It feels good to use as well. For mods, I have Overstuffed Magazine, Choke, Quick Fire Ejector, Tungsten Coated Buckshot, and Turret Whip. My overclock is Cycle Overload. The weapon works great with the sentry gun, especially when you're using that turret whip. My secondary weapon is the Shard Diffractor. I mean, it's a really big freaking laser that melts through normal glyphids. While it's only good on single target, it's really good at taking down Praetorian suppressors and bulk detonators. While it won't melt through them, it will set them up and slow them down for your teammates to get in there and do their thing. My mods are large battery, soft tissue disruption, open structure battery, high intensity heating, and the Dazzler module. My overclock is the efficiency tweak. This weapon will burn through a great deal of its charge and ammunition, so use it sparingly. For my throwable, I use the Shredder Swarm Grenade, the SSG. When you throw this, it turns into four of those little shredder robots you find on some of the robot missions that just annihilate your shields, and it'll go after every little thing kicking around. I used to use the proximity mine, but this happens to be really good and a great replacement for it. I haven't looked back since I got it. My armor rig is pretty much the same as my driller, with one exception. My mods are improved generator, healthy, hazmat system because it's the only option, and I have static discharge. This allows me, instead of when my shield breaks, I go down and take damage, it stuns all the things around me and I manage to just kind of be able to get away and do what I need to do. The passive perks I use are Sweet Tooth, Resupplier, and Unstoppable. These just are very good perks to have when you just randomly want to drop into a mission. The active ones are Heightened Senses and Iron Will. I feel that Heightened Senses is pretty much needed because it will give a little set around to your character. Your screen will turn a little white if a Mactera is after you, the Sand Sharks, or a, uh, oh, oh god, a Cave Leech is down and you can't see it. Otherwise, you have to rely on Bosco or your teammates to come and get you. Well, that's my engineer build. It's pretty generic, pretty easy, drop into a mission without having to worry about specialization. What do you use in your builds? I'd really like to know. Please comment below. If you enjoyed the vid, please drop a like and maybe a subscribe button. I hope you have a great day. Ben out.